YouTube influencer boxing has gained somewhat steady popularity over the past several years, kind of starting off with KSI and Logan Paul, and it's kind of unraveled into this mess where you see some YouTube creator clashes, you see other YouTube influencers, Instagram influencers trying to get into boxing it's gotten way out of hand. And while these influencers will try to convince you that these boxing matches are the best show in town, well, pay-per-view buys might tell you otherwise. But we have breaking news right now that Jake Paul will be fighting Mike Tyson on a Netflix exclusive, I don't know if it's pay-per-view or if you just need to have a Netflix subscription, but Jake Paul will be fighting Iron Mike Tyson Saturday, July 20th at Cowboy Stadium. Uh, I don't know what to say about this. This is ridiculous. We have Jake Paul, who I don't even know how old Jake Paul is. He's probably my age. 26, 27 years old. Maybe he's 28. I don't fucking know. He's in his mid-20s fighting a retired old man Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson has gotten into incredible shape over the past several years with his uh, exhibition match with uh, Roy Jones. We have a few sources here on Twitter. Jake Paul and Mike Tyson confirmed they have signed to box each other in July 20th in Texas. It has yet to be determined if it will be a pro or exhibition bout. I 100% guarantee you this will be exhibition and let me tell you why. If Jake Paul were to beat the shit out of Mike Tyson and for it to go on his professional record, there is no way, there is no way that the WBC will allow Jake Paul to have a professional record win over Mike Tyson. And what does that say about Jake Paul? That Jake Paul beat an old man? And let's say that Mike Tyson beats Jake Paul. And we're not talking about knockouts here. This can be points as well. If Mike Tyson beats Jake Paul... An old man beat up Jake Paul, who Jake Paul has this super hyper inflated ego about how good of a boxer he is. When the only time he's actually fought a professional boxer in Tommy Fury, he got his ass fucking lit up. Tommy Fury beat the shit out of him. Jake Paul has a notorious track record of fighting retired old MMA fighters who are out of their prime. That track record holds true still. Jake Paul fighting Mike Tyson for a Netflix exclusive. You've got to be kidding me. This needs to stop. This needs to stop. These wannabe YouTube influencer boxers. I don't care how much money Jake Paul pours into his training camps. I don't care that he's flying to buttfuck Puerto Rico to be training to fight whoever it is. Jake Paul isn't a boxer. He's not a professional boxer. He's not a good boxer. This is all a scam. And the pay-per-view buys will prove my point. But anyways, Jake Paul fighting Mike Tyson, July 20th, Cowboy Stadium in Texas. What do you guys think of this nonsense? Let me know your thoughts and opinions down in the comment section below. But if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. Share with a friend who you think would enjoy it. Subscribe to this channel if you're new. And we'll talk to you again soon.